Gina and welcome to my channel. Today we are talking about some products from e.l.f. We're talking about their face duels as well as their facial oil mist. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, stay tuned. All right, everyone, today we have an exciting video. We are talking about the brand e.l.f. Now I picked up some newly released items. I picked up the mini face duels, the little bite-sized face duels. I have the shade pomegranate, watermelon, and coconut. I also picked up the facial oil mist in balancing. Going through my collection, I realized I have the Cover FX matte and shimmer duels, and I kind of just want to compare these duels to the face duels and see if there's any similarities. So let's talk about all these fun products. Now, first, we're going to talk about the e.l.f. balancing mist. So I use this under my foundation and I definitely can tell that it just made my application of my foundation easier and I could just tell the difference in my skin. Now, I think this would be a good product for people with dry skin. If you have a thick foundation or a foundation that just might leave your skin feeling dry, I feel like a product like this will just make a difference. Now, the mister on here, is really good it's really fine it's a fine mist it smells really good now i don't have a problem with fragrance so that's just my you know my opinion but i believe it smells really good a little information about the mist that i picked up which is balancing so it's infused with green tea extract known for its youth boosting effect to the skin while geranium oil aroma promotes cognitive focus and balanced emotions. Mist on the face throughout the day as needed for a skin mood boost. So these oil mists are supposed to infuse wellness, beauty. Um, there's six of them. They're formulated with unique blends of essential oils to boost your skin and mood. Um, they have this in restoring, smoothing, balancing, which is the one I have calming energizing and loving so the bronzer that i have here is called coconut and i'm going to go ahead and give you swatches now it does feel smooth in the pan the bronzer feels a little bit smoother than the highlight so here is the bronzer wow that is pigmented they did say these were pigmented and blendable all right, so let's go ahead and try Sunkissed Bronze by Cover FX. I'm gonna swatch these next to each other. So, oh, that's bronzer definitely feels smooth. <laughs> that is the Cover FX bronzer. Now, this one is definitely, I feel like this one's more of a red than this one. This is more of a cocoa color. And let's go ahead and swatch the highlighter part next to this one. Yeah, there's definitely a difference. You can see that difference there. This highlight is definitely deeper. This is more champagne-y. All right, onto the blush. Now the closest match that I found for Cover FX was the watermelon and the soft peach. Now I don't have the other blushes from e.l.f. and Cover Vex to compare those. So I'm just comparing what I have right now. So we are going to go ahead and swatch these. The highlighter. Oh, that's pretty. All right, so let's go ahead and do this blush. Now see, that's the difference here. This one is definitely, this is definitely pinky and this is definitely peachy, but you can see the highlighters. Now I'm gonna go ahead and swatch pomegranate. I feel like a lot of these duels would be good for like deeper skin. I do feel like the e.l.f. duels and the cover effects duels are pretty much the same concept. Now you have the matte side and the shimmer side in both products. You can use them separately or you can use them together. 
is there a difference in shades yes there is but if you don't want to spend money on the cover effects these are definitely a good option let's go ahead and apply the bronzer coconut i'm going to use this real techniques brush it does pick up a lot of products so be careful that's really pretty now it doesn't have a scent to them no fragrance i'm smelling the fragrance so i'm really liking how this product is blending out it's really blendable and you could just really go light you don't need to pick up too much product and you could definitely tell there's like a, a reddish tone in this bronzer but it doesn't look bad it looks perfect for the summer I really think this facial oil mist has just really made my skin look less dull so i can appreciate this spray all right let's go ahead and apply the watermelon blush wow that's pretty let's go ahead and try this highlighter Wow, that blush is really pretty it looks really good with the bronzer too so let's go ahead and use this highlighter wow that's pretty oh is really doing it there's no glitter but you can see that like shimmery sheen look that it's giving you that is really pretty so this is watermelon pomegranates I'm going with my real techniques brush This, this blush is definitely deeper. Good. I'm gonna go ahead and blend this out a little bit, all right? And then use the highlighter. Oh, wow. They really did a good job with this. Super affordable too. Wow. So that is pomegranate. I really like it. It's really like, um, it's a bold blush. All right. I also want to swatch these together. So we're going to do that. Watermelon. That's watermelon swatched together with the shimmer and the matte side. This is pomegranate swatched together. More of a sheeny blush and then we have the coconuts i'm going to apply watermelon on the eyes above my crease get some little color some color on there the shimmer color and put on my lid i'm gonna go ahead and blend this out so i'm gonna go ahead and put mascara on and liner and i'll be right back so we are back and i must say this bouncing facial oil mist, I really like it and I have a feeling I'm going to love it, but I'm going to keep you posted um, about this product in future videos. So stay tuned for that. Now, these face duels, I think they're fun. They're adorable. They perform good. I mean, they just blend easily and they're pigmented. And for $3, you can't beat that. It, it kind of makes me want to get the other, the other shades. So... We might be doing that. And also the size of these face duels are the same size as the the bite size eyeshadow from e.l.f. So just in case you were wondering. Now, are they a dupe for cover effects? I think although the shades are different, I don't have all the shades, but the shades that I have are different. I believe the concept, the idea are really similar. And if you don't wanna spend a lot of money on these, these are such a good affordable option. Now I would say the cover effects do feel smoother to me when swatching. Now, if you guys want me to do a video comparing them, doing a wear test, let me know because I would definitely do right, that. guys, that completes the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Before you go, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like, and comment, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.